All right, we're going to talk a little blues. Maybe just thinking about the ice will cool you down. But have you heard the Stanley Cup is back in St. Louis this weekend? The Blues sharing this photo as the Cup made a surprise appearance at the Muni in Forest Park last night. News for Brooke Grimsley joins me. And Brooke, today, the hometown boy, Pat Maroon, he got his day with the Cup. That's right, Chris. I think everyone in St. Louis has been waiting to see what the hometown hero was going to do with the Cup today, and we were able to get an inside look at one of his stops. Well, the Oakville native's day with Lord Stanley is finally here. It was today. We were there for one of his many stops. He took the trophy to a private event at Charlie Gito's downtown, where they ate none other than toasted ravio raviolis, a.k.a. T-Ravs, out of the Cup. Because, I mean, how can you not, not? in St. Louis? Why not? Ryan O'Reilly was in attendance, but also the Blues' good luck charm, Layla Anderson, made an appearance, eating t ravs out of the cup as well. While this happened downtown, Maroon definitely has stayed true to his roots, taking it around South County as well. well. We'll have more on what else he did with the cup today, including some breakfast out of the cup this morning. And we'll also talk about the big questions surrounding him right now. Will he or will he not re-sign with the Blues? We got a little bit closer to that answer today. All right, Chris? Yeah, 